ask you this. What does it look like to give back during a pandemic? Could be a beautiful piece of artwork. I love this next story. For one woman in Dallas, she saw just how many people were in need and created a beautiful way to help. Sean Giggy has that story. As a professional artist, Brenda Bogart is known for having a good eye. But not even she could believe what she was seeing. Thousands and thousands and thousands of cars lined up at Fair Park to get that one or two boxes of food. It just, it just kind of blew me away. The North Texas Food Bank says lines have never been this long and the need has never been this great. We've never seen anything like this before in food banking, which lets us know that our services are critical during these uncertain times. When she was younger, Brenda likely would have just ignored something like that. But she didn't like that about herself. So a couple decades ago, she decided to do as much as she could to give back. Which is why, when she saw all those cars lined up for food, she felt guilty. And I felt, how privileged am I that I am just a tiny bit inconvenienced by this shutdown compared to people who've literally lost their jobs and, and can't feed their family. When I saw those thousands of cars lined up, I knew what could I do? I could, what could I do? The answer was in her studio. This is one of her latest pieces. And Brenda is selling copies of it at a deep discount and donating every penny of profit to the North Texas Food Bank. Her goal is to raise $100,000, which would provide more than 300,000 meals. Brenda's support is certainly making an impact on those that we serve in a creative way. You know, there's a lot to complain and cry about right now, but what can we do to heal? I can't fix that, but I can do one little thing and maybe inspire other people to do it with me. Like Brenda, you may see that helping others looks a lot like love. In Dallas, I'm Sean Giggy.